We're here with Chris Renane, the uh, president of University Circle Incorporated, and here the Cleveland Cultural Gardens. And it's a, a, a sad day because we learned of the passing of Senator, Mayor, Governor George Voinovich. Chris, can you tell us about your thoughts? Well, first of all, heartfelt condolences to the family, uh, to Janet and to the kids. You know, for us in Cleveland, Mayor Voinovich was our mayor, and uh, he went on to do great things with the state of Ohio and in the Senate, uh, but I think we first know him here in Cleveland as Mayor of Boynton Beach. His heart, his home was always here in the city of Cleveland, and he was a passionate guy who put his heart and soul into the city. Uh, every time, I think, from where he stood in Columbus and in Washington, his heart was in Cleveland. Uh, he'll be known, obviously, with big projects like the bridge that bears his name over the Cuyahoga River. But here in the Cultural Gardens, he's adored. Um, the little things, like getting some signs out on Interstate 90 that direct people to this wonderful cultural gem. Or, in his case, obviously the Slovenian and the Serbian gardens mean so much to him. But when you think of George Voinovich, the 29 gardens that are here, I think everybody has a piece of George Voinovich in their heart. They know that, as a friend of mine said today in a text to me, he was the vitality and the heart of the neighborhoods. And he kept the sort of ethnic communities together and in harmony in Cleveland. Uh, he was a mayor's mayor, I think at 601 City Hall. Uh, it's a sad day, uh, 601 Lakeside. And uh, for all of us, he just did so much for us from wherever he was. And I think, again, most importantly to all of us in Cleveland, his heart and his home was always here in the city of Cleveland.